What is going on guys? Andy Gabs back for another vlog and this is gonna be my last video from Hawaii. I actually fly out tomorrow morning and to be 100% honest, I don't really have a plan for the day. So we're just gonna go kind of explore. We're gonna head to a farmer's market right now probably go pick up some fresh produce. I wanna try some coconut water, all kinds of good stuff. But whatever I end up doing today, I will bring you guys along for the adventure. And uh, I left my other lens in the car, so this one's gonna be kinda of zoomed in for the day. Sorry. So we made it to the farmer's market here on Kauai. I don't know if this is the one that I was initially gonna go to, because the GPS said I had to go like two more miles further down the road, but I don't know. This is the one that I stopped at because it was the first one that I saw. And it seems like they have a decent amount of stuff set up. So I'll walk around, see what they have. Anything I try or buy, I will show you guys. All right, so first thing I got is a like a white pineapple smoothie type of deal, or I think it's just blended up frozen white pineapple. Super, super good. Tastes a little bit different than a normal pineapple, but very tasty. So it started to rain, and it's raining right now, so I had to get back to my car kind of fast, but I did get this white pineapple pepper jelly. Uh, the company that makes it is uh, Monkey Pod, I think. Yeah, something like that, um, but looks really good. So I came up with an idea for today since I didn't really have plans. Uh, since it's raining, I'm gonna time lapse you guys, me driving around the island, and I'm just gonna stop at everything cool that I see. No plans, have not planned out any stops, but if I see anything that looks cool, I will stop and we will check it out. Uh, for now, enjoy the ride to our next spot. All right, well I tried to stop at this place called the Pineapple Store, however they are closed, so on to the next stop. So you guys probably saw me turn around on the GoPro, that's because I was driving and I actually saw a bunch of people fishing right here on the beach, so I figured I'd uh, just pull over and ask them if I could hang out and fish with them for a little bit and they said yeah. So I'll show you guys their setup, they're actually fishing for a tournament for a youth football team right now. So I'll uh, show you guys what they have going on. So you guys can see a bunch of rods, reels set up. Uh, they said later on tonight is more than likely when they'll get into something. So I'll probably end up leaving here in a little bit and then coming back later tonight. Uh, but I'll bring you guys back once I come back as well and hopefully we can get them landing something and make a video for them too. All right guys, so I went to Walmart. I bought a rod and reel right there. They showed me how to rig it up. So we're about to cast and then just a waiting game. So they're rigging up a, a live bait right now on a slider rig for Lua or Giant Trevally. Uh, that's the fish that I really want to catch or see somebody catch while I'm here. I'll show you guys how they do it. Oh yeah. Motherfucker. Right in the mouth. <laughs> now he's gonna die. That one's gonna die. What kind of fish are these that you're using as bait? Ah, a secret that. <laughs> secret. <laughs> It's moving, bro. <laughs> so basically that's it. Put the live fish on, slide it down, and that way he's swimming all over there, but he's still hooked onto the line, so if something grabs him, pop it, and uh, hopefully we get a big ass fish. All right, guys, so it's finally dark out. Hopefully the bite takes off within an hour, hour and a half, something like that, um, but he's rigging up a big bait right now. Just wanted to show you guys. 
big chunk of octopus going on. So he's putting three hooks on it in case the fish grabs it at any point. Hopefully they still hook. My line, I don't know if you guys can see it right there. It's been bobbing a little bit, but no action yet. So hopefully. So yeah, getting this big bait out, and then he's gonna cast it out. If we hook up into anything, I will bring you guys back. Triple. Three hooks. Contact. I get the camera right now. I need the other one. Woo <laughs> I didn't get my expensive <coughs> pull over here by yourself. I am my god. Let's try down too. Yeah. <coughs> <coughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Uh. There you go. Put your feet on the bar. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, I got disconnected. Ow! Got the wish, though. <coughs> All right, guys, we're on. I'm not sure what it is yet, but. We'll get my auto hit. Done if you can. You said you think it's a shark? Yeah. Hello. Hello. Cut the line, big shark. Bring you guys back once we get another one, hopefully. All right guys, well unfortunately, just like all my other videos in Hawaii, I lost a good chunk of the footage that I recorded. Uh, Klaus is making an appearance on the vlog. Um, but I still had an absolute blast fishing with these guys in Kauai. Uh, one of my highlights of the trip was this day and hanging out with them. So hospitable, they were so nice. I mean, they fed me, they let me hang out. You know, no idea who I was, just a random guy showing up and saying, hey, you mind if I hang out and fish with you guys? Um, <clears throat> didn't get crazy lucky. I did have a video of us catching some smaller fish. Uh, we got a Hawaiian surf perch and a couple other fish, I don't remember their name. Later on that night, they did end up getting a giant Trevally. Not the uh, not the biggest one in the world, but hey, a GT's a GT. Uh, definitely wish I would have been there to see it, but I am gonna go throw uh, two of their links down in the description to Instagram if you guys wanna check out some Kauai locals. They are always catching fish and hunting, doing all kinds of badass stuff. So if you wanna follow them, uh, check the links down in the description. I'll link both of their Instagrams. Uh, I would appreciate it if you gave them some love. I think it would be cool to have them gain some followers from this video. Um, they're definitely not like social media, like, I don't know. I don't know how to say what I'm trying to say. Like, they don't use social media like that way, I guess, like we do, if that makes sense. Um, but I still think it would be cool to have some of my followers follow them, tell them Andy sent you. So, no more Kawhi videos, unfortunately, that is it. Uh, I do have some videos from me diving, though. Um, just like little clips, didn't really make a vlog out of it, so if you guys wanna see that video, let me know, and I'll just kind of put it at the beginning of a vlog or something like that. I didn't really like vlog when I went to dive, I just filmed. I guess, but again, the GoPro screwed me over. I swam with a turtle as well as a shark and didn't get any of it on video, of course. 
Uh, so videos coming up. You know, I'm gonna get back to the normal everyday San Diego here vlogs. Got some really cool news for you guys. I got orders, so I'm going to be moving in about four months. Uh, I'm not gonna tell you where yet. Go ahead, guess down in the comments below. Uh, but I promise I will tell you guys soon. Have a really cool video coming up with some pew pews. Uh, so stay tuned for that one. That's gonna be super cool. Me and my buddy Chris Torres from Imperator Arms. Uh, we have some cool stuff coming up. Stay tuned. So guys, thank you for watching. I really do appreciate it. Please like this video if you wouldn't mind. Helps the channel out a lot. Subscribe if you're new here. Turn that post notification bell on so you get notified every time I post. And now that I'm not sick anymore, it's gonna be substantially more often. Uh, I was sick for about two weeks, so that really screwed up my editing. I just, I couldn't really focus to edit. I didn't feel good. But thank you guys. Have a good one. I hope you enjoyed the little mini series on Kawhi. Peace.